It's an incredible case here. It's been called uh, the greatest uh, incidence of travesty, of a, a case of justice and in, in travesty in this country for many years. And she has now walked free Kathleen Fulbig. She had been found guilty and held in prison over the last 20 years for the deaths of three children and in the fourth case, a manslaughter charge. But she had exhausted all avenues of appeal, uh, including another inquiry. And then in the second inquiry, using scientific evidence, it found that two of the children had a genetic mutation that she carried. A third also appears to have a genetic variation. And in the case of those three children, then the fourth case really fell away because the prosecution there had used the argument of... Uh, they had, had used an argument of uh, coincidence and the judge said that that no longer stood up. So really quite an extraordinary case here. Pardoned from prison, but the case has not been quashed at this stage. It will still have to go through a criminal court proceeding there. But a lot of people are comparing it to the Lindy Chamberlain case that many people may remember. Uh, that was when an Australian woman was held in prison for around about five years. She was accused of killing her child, and it turned out that it was later a dingo that took that child from a tent. So all sorts of uh, calls now for this woman to receive compensation and quite an outstanding case and a lot of shock here in Australia today.